Uh, well, this is a little raining and it's uh, are fresh. Oh, very nice. Right here is very, the weather is very windy and temperature is cool. That's nice, it's, it's very, 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 very nice weather. <laughs> Uh, I one question. Can can you see me? Yeah, I know, I know. Can you see hey, me? I, I, I have my my. Uh, the, uh, my no, on the on the on the I see. What do you see? Don't Hello. you see me? Hello. Oh. Good, good only evening. only see you with your. Oh, hey, what, 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 how are you? Tell me if, if, hey, if you're alive. Today? Oh, okay. Uh, doing good. Thank you very much. I'm glad that you're talking and you're talking about the weather in, in, in English. That's good. Okay. Good. We're taking that, advantage to, to practice, you know? <laughs> yes, yes. We we have to take an advance uh, when we have the opportunity to practice with someone, though, uh, yeah. because of many of the times we can, we're not able to do it. Um, yeah. But I'm, I'm very yeah. glad that uh, you're discussing really, about the, it's, it's the weather really nice. now, that it has been winding. Uh, I hear you that it was raining where you live over there. Oh, right. That's correct. Very, oh. uh, a little rainy and very windy yesterday. I I heard uh, how the, uh, the wind was like a blowing, very, very strong, you know. I yeah. said that it's going to drop the trees and everything, the windows. Oh, like oh. A, uh, yeah, that's that's the thing that happened over there. So, thank you. Well, thank you guys. Thank you very much for being here. Uh, we're uh, uh, eleven students participants so far. Uh, did you do the exercises yesterday? Did you uh, answer the questions about it? I can do it, teacher. Huh? Sorry. Were you able to do it, Ivan? I just can do it the homework, teacher. I don't can uh, do it because uh, I have a, a a lot of job. Oh, a lot of work. So that's for, for that reason, teacher. Sorry. Uh, okay, no, no problem. We're going to check on. We're going to go uh um a review but real fast we're just going to check uh, because we need to continue and tomorrow work with the other uh topic actually we're working with the different topics though okay but uh let's uh, let's try to do it here together so yesterday i sent you a uh, breakout rooms and uh you were discussing the possible answers for each uh, each of the questions okay so Everyone, good evening. How are you? Good to see you again. And great that I see you. Uh, I see some of you with cameras on. Thank you very much. As you see me now, so I would like to see you too. Now you know. So different names. Thank you, Carla, Rene, Julio, Jorge, Ivan, Jenny, and I hope the rest can help me with the with the cameras. Ivan, the only thing that we can see you up uh, here, your front head, uh, your forehead. So could you please down lower a little bit the camera, if it is possible? Nice, thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> what was the topic from yesterday, guys? Giovanni, nice to see you again. Okay, what was the topic from thank yesterday? Thank you, teacher. It's a real pleasure. Hey, See you again. Yeah. See you. Great. Fantastic. Okay. What was the topic from yesterday? Uh huh. We were asking what? Services. So, ah, we were asking for services, for uh, services, exactly. And what else can you add to that information over there? Oh, I have a, a out of service. Yes, teacher, I go on from work, but at least I will be connected. Okay, so thank you, Francisco. Just be careful. Thank you very much. 
Okay, so we were talking about uh, asking for services. Let me share the sonido, the, 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 the audio too over here. And um, so this is our session nine. Please uh, uh, be at uh, uh, work on the platform. I, I would like you to remind you to work on the platform and do the exercises, okay? Um, because uh, teacher, um, I don't know if it's teacher, uh, Paola Iglesias is asking uh, for um, to be updated with those. Okay, so uh, today is Tuesday 17, and as you say, we were asking for services, okay? So uh, we were using what? We are using? Uh-huh, uh we, we are using what? We are using? Have or, have or get for or get something done for, uh, to get something done yes to get something done remember that one of the characteristics uh what is the characteristic of the active voice the okay. present verb uh-huh the birds Xiomara? the present verb Ah, and both birds are in the present. So have and fix, okay? Or get and fix are in the present tense. So do you know where I can get have someone fix my bike? Sure, you can uh, have a case sales personal service fix your bike. Or you can get a repair shop to fix your bike. So that's the characteristic of uh, that one. And what about the, the, the passive voice? What is the characteristic of it? We use past participle. Ah, we use on the, on, the second me, on the second verb, which is no have or get, we use the past participle. Okay, yeah. so yes. And do you know where I can get have my bike fixed? And then says, what are the answers? Uh, Ivan, what is the answer? You can? You can get a repair shop. Uh-huh. You fix can your bike. to fix your bike. Okay, to fix uh, the bike. Yes, and that's, uh, remember that on the first on the active, uh, sometimes it can be uh, a routine, habits, or a kind of routine. That's why the, the verse are in the, in the past. Okay, so we're not going to, and um, it's been over here. Oh, let me just get out this one back. Okay, and... So remember that yesterday I said that... Uh, I cut my hair, it's, on, it's a routine, it's something regular done. But I have cut my hair, there was the composition of it. We have have plus object, we, the object is my hair, and the past participle of the verb, which is, um, which is cut. And, but in this case, I got a service. I, on the first sentences that I'm saying that I cut it myself, and that's not possible, okay? So, but in the second sentence, I, I, I am saying over there that I, I have someone else cut my hair, so I pay for it. And that's a, the, the simple present, or I can use the past tense. It means the past participle. It means, what it means the second one? The second sentence, we had our windows clean. What is that means? What is the connotation? The windows are dirty or clean? Clean. The windows are already clean. The windows are already clean. So I had someone clean my windows. So if you cannot see to my house, windows are not dirty anymore. So in the first one, maybe I'm going up to pay for it, or maybe it's uh, from time to time. So the, these are some things. This is on the material over there. Sorry, I didn't get the chance to send you the material uh, the, to have another material. So this is the instructor that we have. Uh, get plus someone plus infinitive on the first sentence. And uh, have someone on base form. 
And remember that which one is the infinitive? Which one is the infinitive? Two. Two. You use okay. the two. two. And two. And the other one is only the base form on the verb. Repair uh, shop is the object, is, is someone, and fix at the base form. But on the second one, I use the infinitive. And the passive voice I use, I have. Uh, have, get, plus the object, which is your bike, and the past participle of the verb. Okay? So that's the cleaning over there. These are the, the words that uh, you were discussing and you were matching, right? Yes, yes, of course. Okay. So you were going to write questions using, do you know where I can get or have someone and then the, the the phrase over here, shorten my hair. So what is number two? Oh. What was number two? Let me go to them. Uh-huh. Number two, what was it? Do you know where I can get someone to cut my hair? Uh-huh, number two is, do you know where I can get someone to cut my hair? Just put it the phrase over there. And I think, do you know? Uh-huh. And number three. Do you know where I can get someone to repair my watch? Yes. Yes, that's the correct one. That's the, the number three. Uh, you're just putting together the, the sentences uh, over there or the phrases, whatever you want to call it. Okay, and number three, number four. Do you know where I can get someone to take my passport photo? Aha. Uh -huh. Ah, number four. Uh, that was number four or number five? Number five, I'm sorry. Ah, uh, that's all right. That's all right. Let's go on that one. Thank you very much. That's excellent. Okay. And number four is, do you know where I can get or I can have someone to fix my scooter? And what about number six? Is there a number six? Yes. Do you know where I can get someone to massage my neck? Uh -huh, to me <laughs> massage my neck, yes. Especially when you're stressed out. You're stressed out. Okay, so you want to relax. Uh -huh. Okay, so ladies, to your husband or to your boyfriend and Boys to your wife <laughs> or to your girlfriend, whatever. Or fiance. Do you know what fiance is? You know what's yeah. fian yeah. Uh -huh. Someone that you're going to marry with, and you should. It's okay, you have a day, you you gave a ring, so that's your fiance. <laughs> Good. Okay. Uh number seven. What is a uh, hey Romeo? Nice to see you. And um and number seven, what is number seven? Do you know where I can get someone to clean my leather jacket? My leather jacket. Uh, here we're using the infinitive, okay, in all of the sentences. But you can use, remember, just the base form. Do you know where I can get someone clean my leather jacket? It's, it will be fine, okay? And the last one. Do you know where I I can get fix my scooter? Ah, oh, oh. thank you, Ben. Uh, ah, the last one it was about the pets, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Uh huh. Okay, but uh, the it's last right. one is: Do you know where can, I can get someone to take care of my pets while I'm away? When on the way, yes, that's the last. One. Ah, that's okay. Now we have the. Is this the active or the passive? Are these the active or the passive? Active. Active. Ah, these are the active, yes. Now viene lo bueno. Oh, thank you very much. I see camera on. Thank you. Uh, so now are you. Okay, good. Okay. And uh, okay, now comes the good part of the, on the thing. Now, 
So do you know where I can get someone to shorten my skirt? And what would be the, the, the using the passive? I guess you have the example over there. Yes. Mm -hmm. What is the, what is B? You can have your skirt shortened. At a, a, main, a main street cleaners, yes. Okay, this is the one that we have before, number two. And what will be, do you know where I can get someone to cut my hair? Uh-huh. And what will be? Oh, re, let me remind you that here you can, you can if someone asks you this, you can say, sure, uh, uh, yes, uh, of course, and you can give the answer, okay? You know what, Mr. Lopez, do you know where I can get uh, my hair cut? Sure. Um, let me put it. You can get it, you can get your hair cut at the beauty salon around the corner. Period. And this is that, the, the passive or the active? Passive. The, no, no, number, number two. Remember passive. that passive number. Um, remember that cut, the past participle of cut is, is, is the yeah, same yeah. one. Yeah, it's passive. the same one. Mm -hmm. And the other, it was, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, why do I have the effects on those? Okay. You know where I can get someone to repair my watch? And the answer is, of course. Uh huh. What is the answer? Of course, you can have your watch repaired at a time shop. At the time shop, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, yes, so, and that's, uh, that's the thing over there. So the verb is in the past participle. And number four, what would be? Do you know where I can get someone to fix my scooter? Uh huh. I don't have it. What will be over there, guys? Uh huh. What will be over there? Tell me the sentence. You uh, can get. Okay, can get. Uh huh. What is the object? The scooter, your scooter. Ah, ah you can get your, uh, your scooter fixed. Ah, uh, your scooter. Ah, uh -huh. fix it. At the workshop. At the mm -hmm. workshop. Okay, let's say at the workshop. Mm -hmm. And that's where we got a good, a good sentences over there. Uh, 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 telling people where to get to. And the other is, do you have this done? Do you do it? No. Okay, could you please try to do it uh, by yourself? Uh, write it and then you put it on the chat. If it is possible that you put your answers on the chat from number five, all of you at closely to at the same time, it would be nice. Remember that we are learning. We're not evaluating if you can do it or not. We are learning. And mistakes are okay. That's the way do you learn, by making mistakes and correcting yourself.
write the sentences if you don't have the document on your, on your in your notebook on a page. We said in the notebook on a page or on the page, whatever. Sorry that I'm drinking water, but my sore throat, uh, my, my throat is killing me from yesterday, since yesterday. Yes. Good, excellent. So number five is you can have your, uh, what was it? Um, uh, you can have your passport photo taken at, a, at the airport, at a studio, whatever. <laughs> Photo floor. That's, a, that's real nice. Uh, Oscar, you know what I'm, <laughs> I'm laughing about it? that many of us are still put in the uh, photo, the photo from Photo Flores in our papers <laughs> from a long time ago. <laughs> that's, that's a history. Yeah, that's, uh, that, every, I guess uh, a lot of people know Photo Flores on that. That's what I'm laughing about, <laughs> thank you. You just remind me that I'm doing the same thing. Okay, so you can say, uh, you can get, uh, uh, what was it? Uh, here again. Um, uh, you can have your passport photo taken at the photo studio, at the airport. So, yes, okay, around the corner. Uh huh, exactly. And what about number, uh, number six? Let me write it over here for him. Do number six mean while I write number five? Okay, that's more or less. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, good, Oscar. And Hector, Jenny, good, thank you. Okay. So you can have your message, uh, your neck message at home, at the hospital. Okay, so yeah, all, all of the answers that are uh, great. Uh, just be careful with the, with the, with the, the, form of the verb that you use on, on that one, okay? Remember that we had to use, uh, it's mandatory to use um, uh, the past participle of the verb, okay? On on this kind of sentence. So you uh, can get 
Oh, let me just put it over here. You can get your neck mat such at remember that when we say uh, when we say at we have to say a place okay at the hospital at home at the beauty salon at at the spa okay you say at the ah but we use the the article uh the but if he, you say that, for example, by someone, you can say you, oh, I make a mean stay with the verb. If, if you say by, by, for example, your wife, okay, or by, by anybody, okay, so you say by. Mm -hmm. And uh, I had uh, thank you guys that you're writing over there. Oh, I got the answer for the other one. So it seems that you need to con you have to continue. Okay, you can have your leather jacket clean at Metro Centro. Yes, at the shopping mall, you can get your leather jacket clean by uh, Tio San Moon. Good, excellent. The sentences over here uh, cover the. Uh, the basic rules, okay? So the rules that we need to, uh-huh. It's just, we're about to finish this one. You can have or get uh, your letter, a jacket cleaned is a regular verb, right? So clean at. Okay. Let's continue. And the last one, do you know where I can get uh do you know where I can get someone to take care of my pet while I'm gone? I guess I I have answers over there. Sure, you can get it. Good, excellent. Uh, you can get your leather jacket cleaned at the dry cleaning. Good. And the last one. <clears throat> Who can take care of my pets, guys? Or how can I ask that one? What is the past participle of the verb take? Taken. 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 Uh, yes, taken. Do you know uh, you can get at someone taking care of, I uh, know. <laughs> uh, what is it? You can get uh What will be over there? The center. Ah, I have it over here. You can have your pet taken care while you are away at Poppy's house. Yes. Okay. You can have your pets taken care uh, at the pet at the pet shop at the hospital, animal hospital while you're away. Yes. You can get taken care of your pets at the puppies clinic. Mm -hmm. In general, guys, puppies, remember that is a P U P P E -A E S. Okay. Okay. How do you feel with this topic? Do you feel for uh, comfortable with? How yeah, do you feel? Sure. Okay, this is it's a matter of practice. Okay, so it's a matter of practice. 
Okay, you can have your pets taken care of while you're there. Okay, good. Taking care of while you're away at, at the Chivo's pet. Yes, if they have a hospital. But yes. Uh, ladies, the rest of you, how do you feel with this uh, topic? Do you feel okay? Do you feel comfortable with? You know, it looks like uh, kind of funny, uh, but uh, as I, I guess I told you the other day, Sometimes, well, when I was learning and I still learning English because you never stop learning. So, and uh, I used to start saying sentences of the topic that I was uh, trying to get on. So, and that's helped you a lot. Even if it uh, sounds crazy, but uh, there are some words like refrigerator that uh, at the beginning I use fridge. You know, there is a word fridge because it's easier than the than the refrigerator and then and then um, meanwhile you learn I, it, you wanted to learn that it's good to stay stood up or stand up in front of a mirror and start saying the word like caca dry look. and I don't think that I do it very good and still but there is another word short word that you can say oh there is a big crock and that means caca dry look, okay so that's, that's helping that, okay? Okay, guys, so uh, fortunately we cannot stop or continue over there, but we will continue with, what is it? Uh, this one. You know, uh, pronounce it, sentence stress. You know, the big, the little rounded uh, canica over there, the little rounded circle over there, it means that uh, the word is, uh, is a little low and the other is up. So that's why, and notice it that, uh, notice that when the object, what is the object of the sentence over there? Where can what? I, uh, I'm sorry? The object is, is it the watch? watch? The watch, the object of the sentence is the watch. Yes, and you know, that's, uh, that's uh, stress, okay? Is not long stress, okay? So let's listen and repeat. This is just to practice uh, how to say the words. Uh, the first time, only listen, okay? No repeat, okay? The second time, we're going to listen and you repeat, but not with microphones. Stay with the microphones uh, off. The third time, we listen and open your mic and repeat, okay? Let's listen. Page 59, exercise four, pronunciation, sentence stress, part A, listen and practice. Notice that when the object becomes a pronoun, sentence B, it is no longer stressed. Where can I have someone fix my watch? You can have someone fix it at the time shop. Where can I have my watch fixed? You can have it fixed at the time shop. Okay, now uh, I'm going to play, repeat the words. I will make a pause, but no with microphone, okay? Page 59, exercise four, pronunciation, sentence stress, part A. Listen and practice. Notice that when the object becomes a pronoun, sentence B, it is no longer stressed. Where can I have someone fix my watch? Okay, everybody. Where can I have Where someone fix have my watch? Where can I have someone fix my watch? Okay. Hey, hey, guys, uh, the second time, repeat but with no microphones, okay? I'm just looking at your photos that you're doing, at your pictures, at your cameras, if you're doing. The third time with a uh, microphone on, okay? Okay, second sentence. You can have someone fix it at the time shop. Okay. You can have someone fix it at the time shop. Okay, third sentence. Where can I have my watch fixed?
Okay. Where the last... can... Yes. The last Where one. Where can I have my watch fixed? Okay, the last one. You can have it fixed at the time shop. Uh-huh. You can have it fixed at the time, at the time shop. shop. Okay. Now, again, but open your microphone. This time, you can open your microphones. Page 59. Exercise 4. Pronunciation. Sentence stress. I will I will send you this audio for you to practice, okay? So, let's uh, see if uh, in a while I can send it to uh, the messenger over here, or I can send it to WhatsApp. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice that when the object becomes a pronoun, sentence B, it is no longer stressed. Where can I have someone fix my watch? Okay, everybody. Where can I have someone fix my watch? Okay, the second one. Where can I have someone fix my watch? Okay, the second one. You can have someone fix it at the time shop. You can have someone fix it at the time shop. Where can I have my watch fixed? Where can I have my watch fixed? You can have it fixed at the time shop. You can have it fixed at the time shop. At the time shop. Okay, uh, before uh, we continue, let me see if I can send you the audio over here, okay? Um, I got lost. I got lost. Oh, ah, the thing is that I'm, I'm sharing. Because the thing is that I'm, I'm sharing. No worries, take your time. Yeah. <laughs> no, but I'm looking for the messenger. The messenger, where is it? Oh, the child is here. <laughs> Okay, let me see if I can get it to all of you. Formato archivo. Let's see. Ah, ordenador. Uh, how lucky I don't remember which ah, 18 <laughs> okay there it is guys I hope that you can download it okay uh, okay so that was uh, that was a little practice with uh, uh, reading in the correct way the, the presentations over there so let's see what is next Okay. Uh, discussion. Oh, by the way, we have a discussion over there, different places, different ways. Uh, useful vocabulary. Uh, what is this one? What is the first word? Commuter bus. Commuter bus. What is it? A bus for people who, who regularly uh, travel longer distance to work. Do we have people like this in El Salvador? Uh, you teach uh, the president. We have. Yes, a lot of people. Uh, in fact, uh, at the place where my wife works, um, there are a lot of people who came from, who, who come from, who comes from, uh, Santa Ana, Sonsonate, Aguachapan. Union. Yeah, and, and they travel every day. And they travel every day. 
long travel, especially with this traffic. Uh, okay, and what is the, the other one, the other word? Portrait. Portrait, yes, and what is it? It's a painting of person painting or people. Personal people. Uh, yes, a painting of a personal people. And uh, where do you see these people? Uh, where do you usually see these people? The, 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 the people? Huh? In the park. In the park, on the street, yes. At, at uh, the center, uh, center historical, yes, exactly. And they say, oh, yeah, picture of you. They, they drop you with a, a pencil or something. Okay, good. And another word is? And bus another ter bus terminal, which is a bus station. And I think there's only four words. Ah, this one. And? Bending machine. Bending machine. And what is that bending machine? A machine where products such as candy or drinks are sold. And how much money, uh, what do you do in order to buy at this vending machine? One car. Coins? Uh, you, uh, oh, you, coins you, yeah. Yes, you put coins on it. Yes, exactly. And uh, you, could, you put a quarter, a dime, a nickel. And a dollar bill. A dollar bill, five dollar bills. I think it's five dollar bill the maximum, right? But uh, you use coins uh, usually, uh, yes. usually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we have a bus, uh, commuter bus, portray, terminal, a uh, bus terminal, and vending machine. This is the vocabulary, your full vocabulary that you will find over there. So for this one, I had a message over here. Oh, you're welcome. Be my pleasure. Okay. So, and uh, you got a, uh, are these services available in our country? For those that aren't, do you think they would be a good idea? Uh, a good idea to have them? I put uh, this one. What is the guy doing on the picture? What is he doing on the picture? Fixing, fixing your suit, but it's ah. on the street. Ah, so oh, fixing, fixing a suit maybe, and uh, another another suggestion. Are they taking measurements? Yeah, okay. something for him. Okay, possible. They are they are measuring the guy how tall he is how. Big is, uh, what is the size of it? Of the yeah, exactly, exactly. So, um, but it's on the streets or it's on, uh, it's on the street or it's on the shopping mall? It's on the street. Yeah, that's on the street. On the street. <laughs> I when understand. You. <laughs> yeah. The, um, yeah. Oh, by the yeah, we do it. Uh, over, we have we do have over here, right? Because in Japan, I understand that uh, there are many people who um, I don't know if it's correct to say and make the suits. Uh huh. And uh, but I guess we have it over here. So that's uh, he's on the street and makes him over there. And those are the questions. That can you. Oh, remember that one other characteristic of the of the passive is that I mean the active is that we put the sentences in a type of question because we use the question mark at the end. On the passive, the ones that we were answering over there, they take the form of a of, of, of a sentence because someone is giving that over there. So and it says, can you have a suit or dress made on the street? Here in El Salvador? Yes, teacher. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh-huh. 
Look at the example that I that I have over there. That, in fact, I took it from the manual as it is, if you notice over there. Can you have a suit made on the street here? And remember what I said? You can say sure, of course, yes. And what is what is the B sentence? Sure. You can have it done lots of places downtown. And and lots of places downtown, everywhere in downtown, I guess. <laughs> yes, thank you. Yeah. Yes. And if there is a, can you have a meal served to you in a commuter bus? Can you have a meal? Can you eat something on a commuter bus so here if you travel from Santa Ana to San Sa Huh? <laughs> The vendors offer you pupusas. Oh, but those are the vendors. Uh, but uh, what what would be the best response to say if the service is not offered on a commuter bus? Mm -hmm. You can start with sorry. Um, are we able to use, I really do apologize, but and complete a sentence? Yes. I think yes. Uh -huh. You yes, uh, sorry, you can say there such a service is not a, it's not what? Allow here, it's not receive over here, so. It's not available? It's not available. Yeah, will be the best way, I guess. So. In that case, you will uh, you will um, you will uh, respond in your own. So the the answers can change from one to another. But you say no, that service is not available over here. Um, yeah, meals are not served in a commuter bus in El Salvador. So you see, you can you can say it in a different way. Uh, can you have your portrait drawn by a street artist? And what would you say? Uh huh. What would you say? You say that there, there is a set that uh, that service over here, and it is. We do have it. Say it again. Uh, can you have your portrait drawn by a street artist? The answer will be B. Sure, yes, of course, you can have it, have it, the past participle of the verb. You can have drawn. it, drawn, where? And then you say a lot of places, downtown, or, or you can uh, address the person specifically to the uh, besides the cathedral uh, and, the center. and the history center. So you say, sure, you can have it drawn at the history center, historic center, yeah. historic center. Uh -huh. And uh, can you can you get your eyes examined in a shopping mall here? Yes, teacher, I can. Gets, uh huh. Can get my age examined on the shopping small. At uh, the shopping small or in a shopping small. Yes. Okay, guys. I need you to talk a little bit. So, um, I I want you to start discussing about these questions and given a, a can a given uh, B answer as the example over there. If the service is not offered in the places that you, uh, we have over here, and then you say, no, that service is not available um, here, there, over there. So you, the answer can be various, okay? Uh, because I need you to interact a little bit. So I will send you like uh, six minutes, no, five minutes uh, to the breakout rooms, okay? I will go, uh, we are 24, making batteries, how many chat eight. rooms? Eight, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, eight, thank you very much.
and I will assign it manually as well. Uh, chat rooms, where are they? Facebook uh, breakout rooms. Mm. Ah, okay. It says eight. Uh, please turn on your cameras, okay, when you're talking. Uh, six minutes. Try to do it. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. The rest is set. I'm going to assign. I'm so sorry, Mr. Lopez. Just for double check, if I understood well, you said that just we need to do the same, but, but in negative form, right? Which one? Uh, the, all the sentences we were answered, or it's the same? Yes, we need to, to continue with the rest that we have. No, you just continue. I, I was trying to oh. give you an, an example, so how to do it. Okay, oh, so. Oh, wonderful. Got you. Oh, thank okay. you so much. You're welcome. Okay, you might be getting the invitation. Okay, you're going to get the invitation right now. It's just like six minutes. Hey, what's up? So, I will ask you the first one and then you can ask me the second one. Okay. Um, can you have a suit or dress made on the street? Mm -hmm. Sorry, I don't understand. <laughs> Could you repeat that, please? <laughs> Can you have a suit or, suit or dress made, made on the street? It's a question that the teacher, sure. Oh. <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I shouldn't be interfering, but uh, Romeo, it's, it's just very simple. Let you say, sure. You can get it uh, made uh, in many places downtown. That's it. Mm -hmm. okay. You can uh, you can get it made in many places. You can you can meet it in many places uh, downtown. Uh, downtown. Yes, yeah. you can get it. It is the soup. You can the, get. It, you it, can get it, it. Uh -huh, made in the past participle in many it. places in downtown. That was that's the same thing that we were practicing before. Okay, you can hmm. get it. it. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ah, come on, don't worry, don't worry. It's okay. Oh, no. It's okay. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> okay, I leave you alone, Sofia and Sara and Romeo doing it. But I will be here because I cannot go from one breakout room to another because my computer got stuck, okay? But I will be here silently, okay? You do it. Don't worry. I mean, you can do it. Sophia and Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't know if Sophia maybe can ask or answer the other question.
Sorry. I uh, I don't know if you if you want to answer the other question or ask me or I don't know. The the last question. Yeah. Uh, can you check your email in a bus terminal? Uh, yes, sure. You can. Um, you can get it. Sorry, you can get it checked in a bus terminal. But if you have a uh, Wi-Fi or internet. Okay. Uh, I can ask you the other one. Okay, ask me. Okay, can you buy clothing from a vending machine? Mm, no, not really. I have never buy clothing from a vending machine. <laughs> okay. Um. Can you get uh, library books delivered to your home? I don't know if um, Romeo wants to answer this one. Um, no, I don't get a library at the home. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Okay. Estoy más perdido ahorita. <laughs> uh, maybe you can say you can't um you can't have them delivered at home or to my home. Mm. No, I I don't have a delivery at home. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, it's okay, Romeo. Don't worry about it. Okay, guys, it's uh, time to go back to um, the main sala. <laughs>